Yo, 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 what's good, YouTube fam? It's your boy, Joe Fit Johnson. I fear God, and I don't fear nothing else. Back at it again, bringing y'all some fire content. If you are new to this channel, this is where we come for fitness, health, mindset development, everything really just wealth building. And I know that I say this beginning of every video, but it's because y'all need to know, man. We're building wealth over here mentally, physically, and spiritually. We talking fitness, mindset, nutrition, crypto, technology, AI, blockchain. We talk, we, we dabble in a little bit of everything. But today, what I'm gonna do is I'm about to bring y'all through my quick, I did an hour workout today. I did a warm up with some cardio, and then I did 10 sets of push, pull, and, and triceps, so push and pull. Um, so I did 10 sets, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do a voiceover, I'm gonna walk y'all through, and that's gonna be um, timestamp on the video if y'all wanna just go through that. But pretty much what I did, it's 10 sets. I did pull-ups, push-ups, and tricep extensions, and I did this as a circuit. So each set, I increased it and I made it harder. So we started off with the easiest progression, so that's just regular push-ups, pull-ups, tricep extensions, and then we added weight to the pull-ups, and then we um, made the push-ups harder by doing a decline, and then by changing up the grips. We also are changing up the grips with the pull-ups, and I, like I said, we're adding weight to the pull-ups as well. And then after the push-ups, we're jumping straight into the tricep isolations to really get the burnout to the triceps. So the reason why I did this today is because I had a quick hour and I just wanted to get a good pump in. A lot of times people overcomplicate workouts. People are like, oh, I need the perfect split. Oh, I need the perfect workouts. Oh, I need the, like, honestly, it's not even about having the perfect workout. It's about how often you can show up. And that's what I want to talk about today in terms of daily deposits, right? How you truly get the body of your dreams and truly make this a lifestyle and, and not only the body of your dreams, because that's literally just the perk of this fitness journey. And I want a lot of people, and anybody who's been on their fitness journey, who, anybody who is about this lifestyle, anybody who's transformed knows that, yes, the body is amazing. Yes, you get confident because the body, you love looking in the mirror. Like, yes, that is awesome. But that's just a small piece of the puzzle. Like, what you get from fitness, this lifestyle, is literally a spiritual awakening. You literally become a new person. You literally begin to ascend and elevate in so many other ways from your business, your relationships, your thought process, your, your, your drive, you just believe in yourself more. You want to go out and put yourself out there more. You're going to start doing things that you typically wouldn't do because you didn't believe in yourself or you didn't have the confidence or you didn't see yourself in that light. But once you were able to commit to this journey and see the power of daily deposits of doing the hard things, it literally transforms people. And I've helped and I've seen it. I've seen it so many times and I've helped so many people. And that's why I speak with such passion and when I talk to people and I'm like yo you can do it I'm not do I'm not talking just from like oh yeah I'm just encouraging you like no you can literally do it I've literally helped dozens and I've watched dozens of people do it simply by having some accountability that goes a long way and even if they don't have accountability having the mindset and developing the mindset and that drive to just show up each day right each day is not going to be the best workout each day is not going to be a two hour just crazy workout literally something i say all the time is literally just show up 10 minutes and this is a trick that that's helped me throughout my journey it's helped a lot of my clients literally just tell yourself i'm going to go in for 10 minutes you just have to break a sweat just get a little warm on your little forehead just get a little warm in your body wear a hoodie go on the treadmill start with a walk work up to a jog do some jump roping go and lift just go on the machines do whatever is easiest for you starting off for 10 minutes you can go do some machines for 10 minutes and you showing up daily each day 10 minutes that's going to compound and you're going to start one you're either going to stay two you can leave if you want to leave but most of the time after that 10 minutes you're like okay i'm here like i've it's not that bad the hardest part is starting and something that i like to talk about is like i keep saying daily deposits a book that's really really powerful on this is the compound effect by darren hardy this is a book that literally literally impacted me so greatly where i would just became so much more self-aware of the power of these small habits i was already on my fitness journey 
I had already transformed and things like that, but it just made so much sense in terms of everything else. The power of these small habits and how they can literally have a huge trajectory on your life on whether you go down this road or you go down this road. Just small things such as, you know, it could be a small thing just such as choosing to drink a protein shake or choosing to go to Starbucks and drink a, a, a frappe, right? That daily habit can either take you to this direction, right, where you're, okay, you, you, you're gonna be more satiated, so you're not gonna go and eat, you know, that 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 uh, fried and Chick-fil-A that you typically would have, because you're more satiated and you're having higher protein, so you're building muscle and you're getting leaner, and, you know, so that, that may lead you into a direction where you're seeing your body change, so that gives you more confidence, so then, you know, you, you may have the confidence to go in, you know what I'm saying, start a business, versus that other direction, you, you're having that frat pay, then that may cause you to crash and then that may cause you to go and make a bad choice and have that uh, fry because you're hungry because all you had was sugar that morning and that's going to cause more body fat and that's going to lower your confidence because you look in the mirror and you're like wow I'm getting fat so <laughs> all that just to say th th that one little habit can take you down a road of either progress and have a butterfly effect on other things in your life that you didn't think about or it'll go take you down this lane where it'll have a butterfly effect negatively on things that you wouldn't think about so it's just the power of your habits and how they compound over time so think about the habits that you're building right and, and something that I like to think about is like we all have bank accounts right we all have financial bank accounts but something that we don't think about is the other bank accounts that we have right we have our um, our health bank account, we have our confidence bank account, we have our discipline bank account, we have all these bank accounts that each day we deposit into. Everybody doesn't deposit into the same bank account, right? A lot of people, they'll deposit into the financial bank account, they're getting paid, they're going to work, but a lot of people aren't depositing into their health bank account, right? Some people deposit into their health bank account, some people don't. Some people deposit into their discipline bank account by, you know, sticking to what they say they're going to do or, you know, um, doing things that they don't feel like versus other people that don't have any money in their discipline bank account. So they struggle with believing in themselves. They struggle with executing. So we all have these bank accounts. So that's something to think about as well. It's like you have to understand the power of compounding, right? Same thing with investing. Investing into whether it be an IUL, whether it be a Roth, an IRA, crypto, stocks, those daily deposits into those accounts, they're going to grow tremendously over the years versus not putting anything in the account and you're not going to have any compounding growth, right? So you showing up each day and just putting a sprinkle of a daily deposit into that health and fitness bank account is going to compound over the years versus you being like, oh, I'm too busy. I don't have an hour to work out. Okay, fine. Start with 10 minutes. Start with a walk. Start with biking. Start with, you know what I'm saying? Um, home workout start with uh, just going on a hike start with swimming start with something start somewhere and then just deposit daily 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 stretching daily daily I was on set yesterday um, well I was on set a few days ago um, with Nike and one of the ph photographers was telling me about how he's been on his fitness journey for the past couple of years and how it's completely transformed his life because he started working out every day he saw himself gaining weight he was starting to become unconfident unhappy so he started working out each day and he's been working out every day for the past couple of years he's an older gentleman and I asked him like what motivates you each day to get up and work out he's like man I'm not motivated at all but it's just become such a he literally said like a spiritual like awakening like it's transformed my being all in all and it just starts with me waking up drinking a coffee and just like as I'm drinking my coffee I just start stretching right and then I get into my yoga stretching out in the morning and he, what he said is he said I just say 10 push-ups just do 10 push-ups and that's that's fine if you just do 10 push-ups he's like typically that 10 push-ups transcends to at least a 20 minute workout out, then a 20 minute meditation he's like man I've never been somebody who was into yoga and meditation and so forth and it, or even working out but it's literally just transformed my complete being where this has become me like I feel so much happier I feel so much healthier and so on and so forth so it's literally just about showing up just show up you guys and if there's one thing that I want you to take away from this is just show up it doesn't have to be at the gym it can be at home but just start it can be with 10 squats 100 jumping jacks just start and it's literally just you overcoming that bitch voice in your mind that says oh no you good you had a long day at work just sit on the couch and relax today like 
tomorrow. It's literally just overcoming that voice and just being like, all right, I'm just gonna give myself 10 minutes. Just give myself 10 minutes each day and I promise you it's going to grow and grow and grow. But you have to keep that in the forefront. You have to be aware of that bitch voice in your brain that says, that's talking you out of your greatness and overcome that voice. And I love this bitch voice term. Shout out to um, Bedros Kulinen. I don't know how to say your last name, but he's the one that labeled this subconscious mind as the bitch voice because it is your bitch voice. It's the voice that's talking you out of your greatness every time that you know you need to do something and you're not doing it so just show up 10 minutes 10 push-ups whatever that may be just show up and that's going to grow over time but you're going to get stronger you're going to um, get more confident in your abilities you're going to get more confident in your ability to show up and it's literally going to just transform whether it be your business your career your relationships it's just going to be amazing you guys so i hope that that helps i hope that motivates you just to show up tomorrow to start your journey or if you're off and you're on and you're off and you're on don't be off and on just be on the more days that you take away the more off days that you have the harder it is getting back because when you get back you're feeling weak you're feeling fatigued your endurance is you're like oh my gosh I feel like I'm starting over it's annoying I've been there I've done that no matter if you're on vacation no matter if you travel a lot I've worked with full-time travelers I mean they're on the road 24 7 and they're still working out in their hotels they're still working out on the road they're still being mindful of what they eat it's a lifestyle it's a mindset how much do you care about yourself about your greatness about the legacy that you're gonna leave and the the, the legacy that you're gonna pass down to your kids and your family and how you impact the people around you because the way that you elevate yourself is gonna be inspiring to those around you so if you really want to inspire and you want to you want your friends to work out or you want your mom and your you know your kids to work out you don't want them to be overweight you don't want them to lack confidence it starts with you it starts with you you can't tell people what to do you have to do it first you have to do it and then they're going to ask you how you do it and then they're going to want to follow in your footsteps i promise you it because i've been there i've done that i've seen it happen i've helped dozens of people i've helped so many people do the exact same thing i know what i'm talking about and if you're struggling to get started if you're struggling with accountability if you need somebody in your corner if you need a strategy where you can build from that's gonna be tailored to you hit the link down below in the description and apply join the waiting list and i will reach out or one of my team members will reach out and we'll figure out if we can help you and if we're a good fit and i'm happy i'm happy to help you like i said we've got the social proof you can click the link below you will see what we got going on literally so many testimonials so many transformations you google us no stack Nation Transformation Academy. Um, also, I'll put the link. Yeah, links in the below. You feel know I me? Mean? We got a free meal plan below too. If you need a meal plan to jumpstart, breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, different ideas, high protein, I got you. The game is free. I'm gonna give you the information. If you need help applying the information, join the waiting list. Spots aren't always open, but when spaces open up, we'll reach out to you. All right. Hit the subscribe. Hit the like, man. Join the No Stack family. We're all about growth. We're all about becoming the best versions of ourselves and leaving a legacy that's worth leaving, all right? How do you want to be left? How do you want your name to be left on this world? And what kind of life do you want to live while you're here? Because we all die someday. People are like, oh, yeah, we're all going to die someday. Fuck it. Well, what kind of life do you want to live while you're here? That's the question. <laughs> no, dead ass, though. What type of life do you want to live? It starts, it starts today. 10 push-ups right now. Let's go. 10 push-ups right now. Let's go. Come on. Five. Do it on your knees if you got to. It don't matter. It don't matter. Start somewhere. Start on your knees.